Oh yeah, Jody. Jody's absolutely one that we're supposed to be going for. Honestly, kind of forgot. Not gonna lie. Hello and welcome. My name is Quark the Tiger, and let's get back to Super Lesbian Animal RPG. We were just getting into some juicy stuff. Okay, so let's see. I think we were just about to... Oh, there's something on the notice board. Let's check that out first. What you got for me? Oh, there are some odd jobs on the notice board. Uh, let's see. Request from Holly. Request from Pepper. I think I actually checked that out earlier, and I'm not going to do that. <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and jump into... Ooh, hello. Who are you? Hey, Rhett. Uh, what you doing out here? Just making sure no monsters try to sneak into town through that hiking trail, standard paladin stuff. If you're looking for monsters, though, I'd head east and check the Amber Woods. The park's crawling with them today for some reason. Will do. Oh, also, you wouldn't happen to know who's responsible for the littering around here, would you? Haha, <laughs> nope, definitely not. You were working here yesterday, though, right? Yeah, weird, I don't know. Maybe you should ask Paula about it. Yes, go after her. Actually, now that you mention it, I haven't seen Paula around all day. Weird. I'll ask her if I see her around, I guess. Oh my god. Wait, hold on. What if she was the one that they were recruiting? You know, to like join their evil plot or whatever? Who knows? Maybe? Maybe that's too on the nose? I don't know. Whatever. But are you guys excited? Oh, he is. Uh, he's not, actually. He was just like, uh-uh, you're not going. Um, I don't think I've actually been on this side of town at all. Um, but are you guys excited? Oh, look! They got a national- <gasps> It's a national park! Cute! Uh, path to Amber Woods National Park. If you see a monster or a litter bug, please call it- Okay, yeah, yeah. I think I s they had something like that before. Uh, ooh! Ooh! Pretty, pretty noises. The Amber Woods. Okay. Dope. Let's go. Who's this? Allison, look! It's our tree! Oh, cool! We did that on a date a couple months back. One of the first dates we went on, actually. Wow, a hike in the woods? Way to splurge on your girlfriend, Allison. Oh my god. Claire, if you grew up here, you'd know that the Amber Woods are one of the most beloved romantic destinations on the Sapphire Islands. And also, it was free. <laughs> She's a keeper, Melody. Well, I thought it was a good date. It's nice out here. Admittedly, there are also uh, usually no monsters. What's with the pl uh, plaque with your initials on it, though? Well, the Amber Woods are a national park, so they don't want people carving their names into the trees. But Allison said couples love coming here, and the tourism board wants to encourage that. So as a compromise, they just let people uh, buy plaques to dedicate specific trees around the park to each other, as opposed to carving them up. And now the tree next to the safe station is yours forever. <laughs> the Amber Woods has been added to the lower section of the quest log. Oh, neat. Okay. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, Jody. Jody's absolutely the one that we're supposed to be going for. Honestly, kind of forgot. Not gonna lie. Oh, so this is the Green Ridge. Okay, so that's the map of Green Ridge that we have. Oh, it's the lore. The Amber Woods. A scenic national park located just outside of Green Ridge. The enchanted amber colored trees that give the park its name retain their hue all year, making it a popular sightseeing destination, especially for couples. Allison took Melody here recently on one of their first dates. Uh, there were fewer monsters at the time. <laughs> Cute. Okay. Well, this is calling my name, so we're going this way. I like how it has like, kind of like a star. Oh, hello. Hello, monster. What do we got here? No! I love them immediately. No, don't make me fight them. Don't make me fight them. They're so cute. All right. What if I'm going to fight them? I'm going to kill them really well. Oh. Man. Oh, Jesus. <gasps> um. Um, it grew. Uh, lovely aura. Restores a modest amount of HP to the whole party. Oh, I forgot. Okay. Um, let's go back. Uh, let's try the saber tooth chop, I guess. And what do you have? Uh, imbues one party's member. Lightning blade. Counter attack stance. Make sure the user more likely to counter incoming attacks for three turns. Um, mm, sure. Why not? Let's just try it. Ooh, whoa, okay. That's awesome. 
Oh, and it poison? Oh, it just keeps getting... Oh, my God! Um... Let's just take that guy out. <laughs> oh, Jesus. What causes them to grow? I gotta check the bestiary. Oh my god. Are they taking less damage? Like, as they get bigger? Or... No. Whoa, okay. Nope. <laughs> okay. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, yeah, cool. Okay. We got the bestiary thing. Uh, let's see. Frog Ball, a territorial species of magical frog that's invasive in many parts of the world. When attacked, they puff up. This isn't just for show, though, as their stats increase with their size. Like most frogs, they are uh, weak to ice and are especially prone to freezing. Okay. All right, cool. Got you, got you. Um, can I get the chest for... Nope. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, what are you? A bloom beast? I love you immediately. I feel like we're going to have to set you on fire. Um, let's do Ooh, fire breath. Oh, it goes to both. You know what? Whatever. We'll do it. We got it. You know what? Let's steal. Let's steal from the bloom beast. Okay, cool. We got some resilience. Flower crown. Ooh, okay. I wonder what that does. All right, let's just go all out. All right, sweet. Um, a cute piece of floral hardware that boosts the user's magic. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Um, I kind of don't want to do that to her, I don't think. But clear. Oh, girl, you ain't got nothing on your head. All right, cool. Awesome. That was that was good. Oh, uh, what about the bestiary? Um, did that... Did I get any more information? No. Okay. Uh, this alligator-like species grows a variety of plants on its back with, uh, that can be used to heal itself. It also tends to ally itself with other monsters to take down larger prey together. Don't let the, uh, the pretty flowers fool you. Uh, these things are bloodthirsty. Use fire attacks to deal with it before its healing becomes a problem. Okay, cool. I honestly adore it. Honestly. It's my aesthetic. Tier Revival. Cool. Bet. Okay, what the heck is this? A giant block of ice is in the way. Claire, do you think you can melt this with a scorch? We need a lot of fire to melt a block this big. I'm not so sure I want to try that on a wooden uh, bridge. Fair enough. Maybe we'll find some other solution. Okay. All right. Uh, don't know what that would be, but okay. Oh, there's another uh, oh, F and J. F and J. I'm not thinking about if there's if there's somebody that we've met so far that would be F and J. But if there is and I'm not thinking about it because I'm dumb, uh, put, it, put it in the comments because I would love to know. Oh, is this an empty plaque? Yeah, there's an empty plaque there. That's such a cute idea. I would love to do something like that. Um, You know what? We're not going to do that yet. <laughs> We're not going to do that yet. I want to go this way. Um, what? Who is freezing hose in here? Oh, another danger. Danger in Monster Den inside. Monsters will attack randomly. Proceed with caution. Was this Monster Den always here? I think it... I think I'd remember if there was a big cave filled with monsters right next to the entrance to the park. Either way, sounds like a good place to stop by if we ever need to do a little training. Okay. Weird. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and go ahead. Oh, so it's literally just a place to train. There's nothing There's nothing else in here. You know, I kind of don't want to be in here to train because I'm going to just die. <laughs> I'm kind of weak sauce right now. I don't want to deal with it, which is the idea of training. But also, <laughs> unless I can, I don't think this actually heals me or anything. Because that would be nice. Nope, sure as shit does not. God, I need better ways of like, Getting my MP back? Okay, let's see if... What's up with these guys? 
Oh my gosh, what happened here? Do you know these two, Mel? Yeah, this is Beth, Beth the Beast and Mary, uh, Marianna. I ran into them yesterday. Both of them are aspiring bards. I hope they're not hurt in there. Claire, do we have a way to get them out? I'd cast Scorch or something, but my fireballs are kind of explosive, so that might do more harm than good. And we don't exactly have the time to try and carefully chisel them out with Alice's sword. Oh, idea. Somewhere around here in the park, there is an old shrine dedicated to Sol Solile? Solile, as in the sun goddess? Yeah, maybe there will be something that could help us at the shrine. What are we going to do? Just go ask the sun goddess real nicely if she'll melt a block of ice for some randos who never pray to her? I mean, do you have any better suggestions? Let's go do uh, some groveling to the sun shrine. I don't think I've seen anything like that recently. Um, I'm hoping for a new spell. That'd be cool. Ooh, is this a th way? No, nope. Sure, nope. Sure is not. And then that's another thing of ice. Okay, another monster. Is there something this way? Um, maybe. What is this? Ooh, okay. Yeah, there's more this way. Man, I love the music in this game. Whoever did the music direction or, like, the composing did a phenomenal job. Okay, come on, Shrine. This feels like the right way. Oh, come on. Ah, oh, come on, leave me alone. Now leave me alone! I loot Scooter. What the? What the? Is this one of those things I gotta, like, defeat really quickly? I'm gonna go all out. It's unknown why loot scooters hoard treasure the way they do, as they don't seem to use it for anything. But naturally, that's, uh, this makes them a target for adventurers everywhere. Uh, these don't pose much of a threat, but they'll flee after a few turns. Be sure to defeat them quickly to claim their prize. Okay, that's what I figured. A bewitched bandage. Please tell me it's like equipment that like does healing over time. Boost the effect of HP and MP healing spells and items used on the wearer uh, by 50%. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Let's give it to you, because, girl, you die often. Okay, there's another chest, and then there's another bad guy. Can I... Do I got it? Do I got it? Oh, ah, don't mind if I do. The Inner Beast Spellbook. Oh, okay. Oh, we already have one of these. Uh, it might still come in handy. Or we could just sell it. And where the heck do I go? This must be on the other side of the river. Maybe that's the ticket. Oh yeah, I'm on the other side of the ice block now. Okay, that's cool. And then I'm gonna go up here, I'm gonna get the spell, and then it'll give me a shortcut. Okay, got it. All right, hello there. This is the shrine. Well, wow, kind of disappointing, not gonna lie. Yeah, I was expecting a little bit more. I was expecting a statue of Solile or something. I guess I can appreciate a good orb, though. <laughs> I mean, hey, what if this orb is closer to Solile's true form? Gods are weird. The way she appears on TV and stuff could just be the for show. Wait, she appears on TV? Wait, do gods like... I know they exist in this world, but like, do they like... Are they just like, hello? Hi, it's me, your god. What's up? How you doing? Maybe it's not the best idea to call the gods weird when we're trying to get <laughs> help from one. Oh, sorry. So, how do I do this? Do I just start talking? Try uh, touching the orb. Oh, um, oh, great Salile, goddess of the of the sun, and the giver of life. Uh, do people call her that? Throw in something about how cool you think it is <laughs> that she made the sun. She'll be able to tell if you're trying to, too hard to suck up. Um, please hear our plea. Please lend us but a small fraction of your sun-related powers, so we may help our acquaintances Beth and Marianna uh, not freeze to death. We will be forever in your debt. Um, um amen? <laughs> well, that didn't work. Maybe she did something and we just didn't notice. No, Salal's a show-off. We'd know. She's probably just busy. Well, I guess it was worth a shot. Salal has been added to the lore section of the quest log. The goddess of the sun and one of the most prominent members of the pantheon of gods that rule over Reveri. Salile is generally credited with the creating the sun. Since the sun is responsible for sustaining most of life on the planet, this makes her pretty popular. So, I wonder what the whole thing is about the gods, then. Um... I... Um... Salile? What is this? Homegirl, what have we got going on here? Um... Bill. Hi! You enjoy your time at the shrine? 
Uh, care to buy any officially licensed Salial merch to remember your trip? Dude, we're locals, not tourists. You can drop the salesman's shtick. Oh yeah, I thought I recognized you. Oh wait, yeah, you guys are the Novas. I think that's the first time anyone remembered the name of our guild. You know, it's the middle of summer. Aren't you hot in that big foam costume? Ironically, in spite of being shaped like the sun, it's pretty cool in here. <laughs> anyway, if you're not interested in buying anything, I should probably get back to being a walking billboard. This might seem like an odd question, but is any of this merchandise enchanted? I consider all of it quite enchanting myself. No, I mean, do any of them have magical effects? We were hoping that uh, to get some help from Salile on our adventure, but she didn't answer our prayer. Oh yeah, totally. Uh, these keychains can call down beams of sunlight and stuff. Here, don't tell me my boss, but I'll give you guys one for free if it helps. Uh, if it'll help on a quest. What? <laughs> what? A sun souvenir. With this, Melody may be able to melt blocks of ice and cure ice-related status ailments. Okay. Wow, thank you so much. I'm sure this will help on our quest. Cool. Well, have a good one. Um, can I buy merchandise? Boy, Salal sure does sell a lot of merch, huh? What does a goddess need money for anyway? I like to imagine she eats it. <laughs> well, that's one way to do it. Here goes nothing. Hey, it worked. Nice work, Mel. What the? What the? <laughs> this game is great. Top 10. Top 10 games. Fantastic. There goes nothing. They're dead. They're still dead on the inside. Most righteous. <laughs> we were starting to think no one would ever walk by and notice us in that block of ice. Actually, we saw our buddy Bill walk by earlier, but I think he was running late for his shift at the souvenir stand. <laughs> it's cool. We understand the importance of punctuality. Are you two okay? What happened here? Did you get attacked by a snowbat or something? Oh yeah, we're fine. Thanks for the save, Melody. Uh, th this was definitely this was definitely no snowbat though. We saw the mysterious cloaked figure lurking in the woods, and as two bards fighting for truth and justice, we knew <laughs> that was no good. Uh, they tried talking to the cloaked. They tried talking to the cloaked figure, and then uh, we got frozen. Admittedly, mistaking mistakes may have been made. Yeah, I think we might know who's responsible for this. I think we're definitely on the right track here. We better keep investigating. Right on. Well, thanks again for uh, thawing us out. Oh, don't sweat it. We will sweat it, actually. <laughs> we'll be sure to repay the favor someday. Adventurer's code and all that. Anyway, see you around. I want them as a summon. I want them as a summon so that way I can, like, have <laughs> them come in. <laughs> like, like here, I'm summoning my friends. I, you, owe me their, you owe me your life. <laughs> <laughs> all right and with that uh, i'm gonna wrap up this episode here um i don't know what's going on <laughs> i wasn't expecting ice powers i guess from this guy so that makes me feel like we are uh going to be encountering somebody other than what was it javis javis cassette tape head but anyway thank you so much for uh watching so far let me know how you think the the series is going let me know how you think the game is going and if you liked it leave a like all that stuff and uh for now this tiger is out of here <laughs> Bye bye